This section is about plotting polar equations by hand. That is not a skill I value and not a skill I intend to teach. So our engagement with this section will be quite light. Instead, Let's look briefly at the graphing technology we have available to us. We'll start with our calculator. Here's a TI-84 calculator, um, or rather an emulated version of a TI-84 calculator. I legally extracted and uploaded the bios, so it's all above board. If we press the mode button, And we select pole for polar. Then you see we can plot polar equations such as r equals the cosine of our variable button when I press it now gives us theta plus theta. And I can graph it. And I can go to windows. And I can control things like, by default, theta goes from zero to two pi, I could increase theta to see more of the spiral and stuff like that. So our calculator can handle polar coordinates. And the other graphing technology we've seen a lot of is Desmos. And certainly Desmos can handle polar coordinates. We type R equals so it knows that we are doing polar coordinates here. We type the letters theta to generate theta. R equals the cosine of theta plus theta. And as our calculator can, we can get graph polar coordinates on Desmos as well. So I'm not really interested in learning to do stuff this by hand. That's very messy and very difficult. And in my opinion, is hard to justify the time you'd have to spend on it. But we do have options available to us if we want to know what a polar curve looks like.